Hi, and welcome back to this week's video. Today you're about to see a video that, well, it didn't go as planned when I was filming it. Uh, I still like the video and I still kind of want to post it because it was still a cool idea, but it's kind of crooked because I thought I leveled my camera, but I didn't and this building is old and the floors are kind of not super level. So um, I'm sorry and here we go. Here I have two Dollar Tree broom handles that we are going to turn into curtain rods. I have twisted and popped the top of the broom end off. I am going to attempt to take these UPC stickers off. And nope, those stickers are not coming off. I tried soap, water, and scrubbing. I'm hoping that the curtain will cover the stickers and we won't even see them. I also have two packs of these black hooks from the dollar store. I've already measured and marked where my holes are going. My floors are uneven, so I'm hoping it's level. I am just hand screwing these in. I am using two hooks for the middle. I did not put any screw anchors in because the curtains and the broom handles are very light, so it's not necessary. If you're using something heavier, you should use screw anchors. I did run into some trouble on this side as there was a steel beam in behind the drywall. I then puttied up the hole and I will paint over it. I re-measured everything so that I could find another spot to put the hook in and we screwed it in. Now it's time to run the curtains through the broom handles and hang them up. The covered up picture on the wall is something YouTube probably wouldn't like. I know you're probably wondering because I would be curious too. Now we're just straightening everything up. I know it looks really uneven, but it actually is not. It's just because my camera is super crooked. I just get excited to start these projects and then don't do enough checking to make sure things are level and lined up. Future note to self, triple check camera levelness. I'm really happy with the way that this turned out. It just makes everything look nice and neat and tidy. This whole project cost under six bucks, including tax, and I like it. As always, don't forget to subscribe and click that notification bell so you never miss an episode. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next Wednesday.